Classic Pueblo tradition. Volunteers came together to turn donations into a Thanksgiving feast to remember. KRDO News Channel 13's Katie Spencer is live in Pueblo at the Union Depot, where close to 2,000 gathered for this annual community dinner. Katie, this event isn't just for the homeless either. Yeah, Bart, of course, the homeless count on this meal, but there were many others who came here for cheer and to make some new friends. 140 turkeys, 220 pounds of potatoes, and countless pies awaited the annual community dinner in Pueblo. This is a meal for people who don't have a place to cook, can't afford to cook. It's for the lonely, it's for the elderly, it's for those who may have lost a loved one recently. About 2,000 people shared a smile, a laugh, and all the fixins with family and friends. It, it means everything in the world to us. While some come here for the company. My dad passed away, my mom passed away, and this is a good place to come and have Thanksgiving dinner. Many others are homeless and are looking for a little holiday cheer. You know, I have a wife and two kids in Minneapolis. Uh, my mom's there, my little brother's there, my sister in law's there, my niece and nephew are there, and so I'm just trying to get home. This is the 35th year this dinner has been served, and it couldn't continue without the support of the community. There's so many different events during the holiday season, and yet, they still manage to make each one important. And for those who count on it most, this community feast means more than a full belly. I want to tell the people of Pueblo, thank you for all that you do for the homeless. This is the face of homelessness. We all have a past and we all have a future. And for right now, you are doing everything you can to help us. And it means a lot to us. This dinner was in memory of two Puebloans whose lives were cut short. Hear from the brother of Devin Clark about how their family is getting through this, their first Thanksgiving after the tragic loss. That's coming up tonight on KRDO News Channel 13 at 6. Live in Pueblo, Katie Spencer, KRDO News Channel 13.